and thank you for watching my virtual Meet the Teacher PowerPoint for College Math. My name is Jenny McNutt, and I have listed my email right there for you at the beginning, so feel free to copy that down and email me if you have any questions throughout the semester. A little bit about me. Um, I have spent my entire career teaching here at Peoria High School. This is year 30 for me. This is my first year teaching college math. We haven't offered this course on campus for at least the last 10 to 12 years. Um, I also run the student council program and have been the student council advisor for the past 27 years. Tutoring is available for your child Tuesday and Thursday from 2.30 to 3, oh, that should say 3.30. Or you can have your child discuss a different time. I'm always willing to work with kids if those times don't work. I am planning um, at this point, we have probably a good half hour to work on homework daily. So I am able to walk the room and help students individually as they ask for help. But a very big uh, component of doing well in college math will be being able to advocate for yourself and asking when you're confused. And that is just a lifelong skill that will help students um, throughout college and work and all of their future endeavors. All right, topics covered in college math, things we might need to ask for a clarification on. We've done our sets and Venn diagram unit. We're currently learning about Roman, Greek, Mayan, Egyptian, Babylonian, and Chinese number systems. So your child can impress you by their knowledge of being able to translate their um, any given number, say, into a Babylonian number or a Chinese number. Um, we do geometry, some finance, metric. We do a lot of stats and probability. I'm sure there's a few topics that I have missed there, but that gives you an overview. College math is um, much different than college algebra. This class does not necessarily practice the algebra skills necessary for students to be successful in future math classes, college algebra, pre-calc, trig, calc one, and so on. This class is a standalone island and works really well for students who are going, who want A, the college experience of in high school of what it's like to take a dual enrollment class, or B, this is their exit class for the major they choose to be in in college. So maybe 15 to 20% of the college majors out there have college math as the exit math class. If you would like more information about that, I have made some packets for my students. We've talked about it in class and feel free to um, ask for clarification and I can send that electronically. Here's a little bit about our grades. They're pretty straightforward. I do not update grades on a daily basis. Um, I have a full schedule this semester and I tend to do it unit by unit because one homework assignment in the mix of 50 homework assignments is not going to impact a student's grade very much. It really is chapter by chapter that's going to have the biggest impact. Every chapter we have a test. This being a college level course, retakes are limited. Um, there are some students that will need to retake that first test, but most children did phenomenally well on the first test about sets. And as we go through the semester, I would be willing to give students one or two retakes, but that is about the limit to which GCC would allow. So I have to stand by their curriculum as well as Peoria school policy. Each chapter has homework. I clump it all together for one giant homework grade. So for instance, if a chapter has six sections, it would be 60 points worth of homework. If a class had five sections, it would be 50 points worth of homework. And most chapters have a quiz, so I can do some checks for understanding and make sure that students are with me before we finish the chapter. Um, just some ending items. 
If you're ever confused about policies or things like that, uh, I did hand out the course syllabus at the beginning of the semester, and there's always good information in general on the school's webpage, and you should be able to access grades at any time on Parent View, and then please email me with any additional questions. Thank you for watching, and have a great night. Bye-bye.